Hello, I'm Steve Hoselton from Anvil Brand Shoe Company in Lexington, Illinois. We've been here since 1978, making horseshoes, tools, and now anvils for the ferry industry. Uh, we own the JHM uh, anvil line. It's made in Texas and brought in here and finished and machined and heat treated here in central Illinois. I want to talk to you today about quality and, and, and a couple guys in charge of the production of those and where they come from and, um, and dispel some myths out there uh, that are on the internet and around the world about anvils. It used to be that a forged anvil was the only way to go, but that's not so today. With today's technology, we're able to pour anvils in Texas uh, uh, with a high level of quality. So good that uh, since 1978, JHM anvils have been made. And uh, since we've taken the company over, we've never had one come back. So the level of quality is there. It doesn't have to be a forged anvil. Yeah, you're, you're going to hear about all four processes we do with these anvils here today. Uh, uh, from the pour at the foundry, uh, they come in here and get machined here at this machining center. Um, they come out of the machining center and we go to heat treat um, where it gets uh, through heat treated and tempered. Comes back out of heat treat and comes into our facility for some final touches and real the final quality check on the product when they're polished and um, ground and painted to go out the door. I'm going to introduce you to my brother Stuart. He's a manufacturing engineer. He's going to talk to you a little bit about how we machine them. Uh, when they come in after the pour. And then you're going to hear from Mike Rourke, uh, our production manager here for over 16 years. He's worked with a lot of steel, seen it hot and cold everywhere we got it. And he's going to tell you how we finish them up and make sure they go out of here without any imperfections in terms of pockets of air in the horn or in the tail section or in the base and final inspection on them so that you get a high quality anvil, the best on the market today. Um, we are the number one sellers of anvils in North America. It's called JHM Manufacturing. Um, we sell about seven or eight from 70 pounds right on up to 260 pounds. We have the blacksmith in mind and the farrier. Um, our business is ISO, which is a, a standard of quality you have to meet to be registered. And I'm Stuart Hoselton with Anvil Brand and just want to talk a little bit about the machining portion of an anvil. Um, what we do, first of all we can talk about what it's made. It's a, it's a ductile iron. Um, it comes from a foundry in Texas. They go to great lengths on their quality control department to make sure that the consistency is there and they, they run tests on every, every run or lot size that they do and it's a thimble size test that they take in and make sure that the consistency is there with their uh, ductile iron. And then once, we, once it's done there, then it's brought into our shop and the first thing we do is some, uh, a couple of machining operations on it. First, first thing is the bottom of it and then we turn it over and do the top and drill the hole and we go to great lengths and making sure that those two surfaces are very parallel. Um, it's really, we feel, real important in the anvil. This is the CNC milling machine that we use to machine the anvils. Each, each anvil has its own program, so therefore we got quick setups, which helps on the cost of the anvils. Um, obviously the different sizes require different tool adjustments, but each, each anvil has its own program and all we have to do is pull it up and go. And then as you can see, that's, that's one of the cutters we use. So we're able to take it in one, one pass. And, and again, it's all automatic tool change. So you go from one tool to the next without any labor. It's all done by the machine. And again, each, each anvil has its own tool adjustment. Hi, my name is Mike Rourke. I'm the production manager here at Anvil Brand. I've worked here since 1990. Uh, once the anvils go from this shop, we, I coordinate the heat treating process, which is in Peoria, Illinois. Um, they get oven baked, 48 to 52 on the Rockwell C test. Um, once they get back from them, back to our shop, we take them to our another facility here and we hand grind, we do the finished product, hand grind them, inspect them to see if there's any air pockets from the sand molds. Then we'll start our grinding process, which is just fixing up the anvil, cleaning it up, taking off the ridges and stuff. And then we go to the polisher and then we polish them, paint them, tape them, spec them one more time, and then we ship them out. Once it gets back from heat treat, this is the finished product. Yeah, we make a, a, a large variety of anvils here at Anvil Brand, uh, the most in North America with the highest quality. We start out, we've got a 70 pound here. Uh, in between that, we have an 80, we have a 100, have a 120 pound, 125 pound, a 160 pound, and uh, the JHM competitor is 260 pounds. 
We also make the anvil for GE Forge and sell it here as well. So when you're looking for quality in an anvil, check our website out. Remember the quality is how it's made, not in the sound of the ring. And uh, you can find us at anvilbrand.com and check out all the videos on hoofwatch.com as well. They've been a lot of help for us. Thanks, folks.